another LED light yeah. bar on 24 volts. Low voltage lighting system. Low voltage lighting system yeah. off of a solar yeah. system that I'm going to show you from Gain Solar. He's going to give me the tour. The all right, we have a 6KW array in this uh, brand new, beautiful barn, shop, whatever it is, but there's a really nice solar array. Would you have a catwalk up there to get to it? We built a catwalk so we could access it. It's got a combiner box up at the top. It's got six strings of four Solar World 285s on two Midnight Classic 200 charge controllers. 200, huh? Yeah. All right. And right down into the that was fun to hang on there for dear life. You have a. That was a lull. You gotta use the lull to lift all the modules up. Yeah. All right, let's go see the inside. That's a pretty cool setup. Okay, I'm in the shop right now, and he's about to turn the lights on. This is a DC. All DC. You're about to see about one amp of lighting. One amp of lighting. All right, those are spots. Some spots on the side. Some. Wow, that's nice. Spots too. Two Let amps. this put two amps. Wow, two amps current on this at 24 volt? Yeah. That's awesome. All right, I need this for my building, for my shop. That is cool. Where's your Magnum? Oh, here it is. So we're, uh, battery's at 88% today. It's a cloudy day. We got a Magnum MS4448 PAE inverter. It's 120-240 split phase power right out of the box. Um, it's got the MMP panel on it. It's got dual Midnight Classics charging the battery. Nice and symmetric. Lots of battery protection on What's, there. Let's see the battery. Protection. You got us a uh, Crown 395 amp hour. We got eight six volt batteries or 395 amp hour 20 hour rate. We got our two aught cabling with our automatic watering system. Nice. Gain Solar Special. <laughs> and, I like uh, the battery box, man. Yeah, this battery box. Is, what is that? A pool box? No, it's a trade secret. That's a trade, trade secret. Trade okay. secret. Okay. We have custom. They're custom made. They custom. That's wow, right. you're busy. We got our um, DC load panel. Can't open that up for you either. It's all custom. That's proprietary. Yeah, proprietary. And this is our AC panel for the barn. Feeding circuits all around the barn. And let me take you to one little more, one more gym. And there's a this. sub panel for the house. So this, that, is this the sub panel for the house? That sub panel is for the that's feeding out to the house. Okay. And then this is, this this is going is, to the house this for is, critical loads this out is there. This feeding the house. This is the breaker feeding the house. And then this is all on solar too. So we're sending 30 amps to the house. Yep. Okay. And then look here. This is really cool. Our DC 12 volt lighting system. Why did we do 12 and not 24 well, on this we, one? We, 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 we got an RV park close by and we, we figured out a lot of RV appliances. Uh, coming out of here and I wish they didn't want just a little bit deeper, you know, for us tall people. But, uh, <laughs> this, uh, so yeah, this system, we've got 120 volt AC coming down here from the inverter, but then we've also got uh, a converter, uh, a converter, transformer. Control. That's another one of those rail car guys. That's all proprietary. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> and uh, so he's got 12 volt down here. You can top, tap off that if he wants. Right there. Just because you had the 12, you want yeah. to do some 12, some 24, this and just try it. Cool. Oops. Hey, it's super dark now. Hold on. So, oh. when you're running low voltage, if you're in low voltage class 2 and you're under 100 kVA, you don't. You can use little pretty plugs everywhere. It's a really nice way to light things. Wow. This, this is the arm. These low voltage strips, this is you what wanna... you call. <laughs> you call this a solar DC microgrid. But this is strip lighting. It just comes in a roll, man. This has come on a roll. Really? Yeah, it's just, just with the light strip. Light strip on a roll. 12 yeah. volt. So I'm gonna roll it. Nice. Look here, Scott. Okay. Our engineer. So, if anybody's ever thinking about it, if it's something you can keep in your preps, something you could throw in there is 12 volt ribbon light strip. You can get a ribbon of these real cheap, and um, you could have an untold amount of light on a little ribbon. You just can run it wherever you want. Runs right off 12 volts. That is slick. That's the 12 volt.
folks, this is Johnny Valentine. I'm out here in a remote location with my 2.565 solar array. It's a 2.565 kW solar array, solar array comprised of 285 watt panels. Got nine of them. She's just bringing down the DC current. You can see over there in the corner, we got our combiner box. It's an MMPV6 midnight combiner, and she's just pumping down the power. Come on in, folks, and we're going to show you the power plant. All right, folks, in here I got my Magnum 4448 MSPAE inverter. She's pushing out split phase 12240, and she's just cranking out the power into the secure loads panel. He's got his fridge. He's got his freezer. He's got his well pump. He's got everything he needs, and you better believe she's going to run when the grid's down. In here, folks, I got my 48 volt crown 395 amp hour battery bank with automatic watering kit she's tuned she's greased she's ready to go she's torqued down and she's going to provide that power when the grid goes down call us today folks we've done it before tesla gain solar